everybody, welcome back. It's me, Babe Rue, here, and welcome back to the uh, Mirage walkthrough from the Storm Wizard. Um, okay, so if you remember last time, we ended up freeing uh, that little mm, tabby, whatever his name was. Can't think of his name. <laughs> Give me a second. I can't think of his name. I think it's here. Paul Atreides. Uh -huh, yep, that's his name. I knew that. <laughs> um, uh, we helped free him from, uh, um, what do we help free him from? Mind control. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mind control. Uh, I think I'm under mind control. No, I'm just kidding. Um, but yeah, so we did that, and then he sent us on an errand to go to these other people, and he was like, uh, I'm glad I'm not you, because I don't want to go see them, and blah, 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 blah. So we have to go see them, and that's just going to be great. You know, it's just, it's going to be a lot of fun. No, no, no big deal, but, um, kind of scary, but, um, I don't know what to expect, so I can't say anything, so, but yeah, so we got that to do, um, and this place looks like a barren wasteland, kind of like what we did at start, and there's something blinking right here, is this something special? <gasps> antique, antique egg, I, wow, I butchered that word, I thought that said antique, or something like that, but, interesting word, very interesting. So we're go supposed to go to some other people now. I eventually yes, they're probably not gonna be as nice. They're probably gonna be more rude and blah blah blah. Oh, she's already here. Wow. Hello. So I have good news and bad news. Uh, good news is no fight for the lordship of House Calixco. Bad news is that the Baron is a little paranoid. Uh, he's a little bit of a paranoid. Why? Interesting. Wow. In other words, we gotta fight him. I can teleport back inside, but you'll have to rough up the Calixco guards until one of them get the key, come inside, and hopefully by then I'll have found a way to get us an official audience with their code. Good luck, Master. I just walked right through them. I was about to say, I was like, I just walked right through them. They don't, like, respond. It's very interesting. Okay, so... Um, don't need any of those things there. I don't even need that. I'll probably just get a Tempest or something and just flash them. Wait a second, I have over 100%, so how did I get a regular pip? Do they do things like... Sorry, I just cut off mid-sentence. But, do they do where you have like over 100%, like 100% is not 100%. It's like 120% is 120%, and 100% is 100 out of 120 Interesting. I don't know, I just kind of bantered there. That was a lot of banter, but it's worthwhile banter. Um, we don't need that. I don't need. I don't even need Aegis right now because I don't think balance w people have any, like, remove war charms. I don't think they do. They don't have disarm, and I don't think they have anything like steel charm. I think that's a fire storm exclusive, or exclusive spells. I don't know, though. I'd have to make sure. But, um, strategies with, uh, these types of people is just to easily kill them with, like, one-shots, because that way they don't do as much damage. Um, they can't really cause that much damage anyways, because, see, this should one-shot them. And with, um, my Storm Wizard, I think he does 128 or 131. Um, doing, like, what damage I do, like, say, for instance, that was, what, 1460? Uh-oh, well, that might hinder things, but multiply that by 1.30... Three one. Oh wow! Well, I I can't even. <laughs> Two point three one. Okay, and with those couple, that should break the barrier. That's gonna be a little bit different. I have to pierce hers, but no biggie. Took care of it. Okay, and we have these little healing things around. So we went ahead and collected the manor key, which was good. I was kind of surprised, because normally we don't get that stuff. We don't get that lucky. But, um... She did She said, I'm going to find a way to get us both in. She did not. Dr. Yo... You... I feel like we gotta fight this guy. The Baron is a very sick man. One of the effects of his illness is that he's very... Let me guess, you have him under influence as well. Some say he can be quite cruel. 
anything to research on. But if you seek an audience, however, you're in luck. I've just left him in his audience chamber. Go on. Okay, before we fight him, I want to see what his um. I want to see what his uh strengths are. Bear, oh, there he is. Ah, okay. I feel like he's got to have some form of cheat. Okay, well, he's got a lot of cheats. That's kind of scary. Um, he's got nine health. What? Okay, um, I don't know how to fight this guy. Welcome to the... Okay, his cheats are that, um, if, if a wizard joins the first round... Uh, after the first round, he casts a steel pips. He'll steal three pips. Um, at the beginning, he casts a permanent minus 200% version of Brace. R that makes him immune to all damage. R says invulnerability when used. Wizards can only damage the Baron after defeating all of his minions. Okay. Armor piercing that de deals more than 100% will bypass the R's effects. Okay, I don't have any. Okay, this is a lot of difficulty. Um, I don't really know how to defeat this. I don't know how you can defeat him. He's only got 9 health, too, which is... I'm going to look up something real quick. Baron Herkonen. Herkonen. Okay, I want to I want to make sure that that's like the website. Okay, um, if I have to, I might just have to stop by and go grab like some infallibles or um, some piercing spells. But I don't I don't think I will need them. Um, let's see here. All right, let's see. Here. Blah 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 blah. Okay. Blah 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 blah. Okay, I don't know. This doesn't help me out. This is difficult. Alright. So, I say, before we get him, let's go and grab some piercing spells. So, let's go do that real quick. Okay, so I'm already looking for some cards on here that can, um, help us out here. Infallible looks like a good candidate because it gives us 20% pierce. So, I'm going to buy several of those. Um, or I'm just going to buy all the ones I can gra get and grab. Well, I grabbed the wrong ones because these were cheaper, but it's fine. I don't care. So I'm going to grab 10 of those because my thought process is if I could get two shadow... Well, actually, if I could just get a shadow pip, what I could do is I could one-shot him with um, maybe like a levy or something. That would probably do the trick. Um, there's a lot of monstrous, but I don't need monstrous. That's for, like, my other one. Um, I'm also thinking maybe getting, like, um, something that also could add some, uh, pierce. I'm trying to find it. Where's it at? Sniper doesn't know. That just adds accuracy. It's, um, no, it's the one above Unstoppable. What is it? Uh, if I, I'll just go ahead and grab a few of these because Unstoppable is a very useful card for something, uh, like that. Um, because it will add to it. Um, actually, let's go to, uh, the Arcanum, because I know that there's a spell that kind of adds accuracy and stuff there, but I don't remember exactly what it's called. Um, I don't remember, but I know where to check for it, though. The Panopticon, Astral School. Okay. Alright, so what is it? It's not unstoppable. It's... Wow, he's got a lot. Um, radical. I don't need ra radical. Um, <laughs> flawless. Well... That's no different if I wanted to get infallible. But we already have like the treasure card, so that kind of makes that useless. Brace doesn't need it. Um, 
when I checked his cheats, it adds a 200% decrease. So as long as I could get something that's like over, I don't know. I just need a lot of help with this. Indemnity, I've thought about that, but that's no help right now. Um, Frenzy, I don't think that's helpful either. Nor would Berserk be any help to me. Um, let's see here. Extraordinary, that's it. Okay, but... We got the treasure card equivalent of Unstoppable. Let me go check real quick, though, for um, Extraordinary, because they might have that as a treasure card. Okay, so let's look here for Extraordinary, I think it was. Maybe they got that as a... Um... Okay, they don't have it. Um, they have all the stuff that I don't need. Fortify is kind of useless. They got Empowerment, but that's no use to me. Empowerment doesn't really help you out that much. Um, I don't think Ber Berserk would actually be as effective because it doesn't increase your piercing damage. So I just need stuff that pierces. So like that's why I need Extraordinary. Which judging by what they got, I don't think I'm going to get it. So okay. So my strategy is... Alright. So I have all these cards in here, right? Um, those cards are completely pointless. So my thought process is maybe what I might do is I'm probably going to remove these all the stuff from my deck. So let's see here. How do you clean or clear your deck? All right. All right. I don't need any of those. Okay, I will need... Okay, I will need one of those, obviously. Um, I don't need a le levy for that. Add a few sharpened blades. Um, I don't think I saw on there that he uses uh, disarm or enfeeble, so I can just okay. So that's what I'm gonna put in there right now. Um, yeah, I have a lot of useless spells. I just need to go through and like destroy. Maybe put a potent trap on him. But I I read somewhere that he r might remove traps. I think that's what he does. But okay. The piercing strategy. Okay. Um. Blah 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 blah. Um. Okay. It's only able to damage him after that. So he's only got three minions. But I don't think that they're at, at any point effective against me. Yeah. See, they've all got weeks. Uh, they they're all weak. So what I might do is I think that um. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, I'm, like, reading this. Um. Alright, yeah, okay. So, I don't see anything on here that he ends up, uh, uh, damaging, or not damaging, stealing. So, I might just put a, uh, um, potion trap. I'll put a faint. And I can't speak. Wow, what the heck. Um, put... Two of those in. Actually, I only need one of those because I'm. I'm just gonna put one of those in. Um. Yeah. 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 All right. So that's pretty much all we need. Okay. Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go to shadow. I'm gonna put. I don't even know why I have all these to be honest. I just need that. I'll put a shadow strike in there. So hopefully I can summon that or get that. And then, um, for spells. Actually, I'm only gonna. Um. Um, whoo, one of those, um, and one of those, and then I'm gonna put, not levy, I just need something that, since he's only got nine health, if I can use pierce on him, I just need something that can, um, uh, a stormzilla, actually, um, triton's a good one, I like triton, um, and as a fail safe, I'll end up putting, like, levy in there, levy should counteract that, though. Um, okay, for treasure cards, okay, all we need to do is we need to find, I'm pretty sure I bought treasure cards, where are all my treasure cards? Oh, I, never mind, all treasure cards. Okay, I was wondering, I was like, where are the other ones at? Um, oh, I already have some extraordinary, excellent. So I'll put three of those in, I actually don't need that now, because I already have extraordinary. I didn't see, I need to check my deck beforehand. Mm -hmm -hmm. Okay. And where's Fortify at? And not Fortify, Infallible. I'm gonna put just three of those in. Because that'll add the Aura effect. 
Um, so I guess the strategy is put those two on after I get the shadow pip, cast those, cast the shadow pip, um, shadow strike, um, save up my pips, and then fire a good, good old bolt at him. Okay, we're ready. I'm a little nervous, but it's not gonna be that bad. I, I cannot tell. Oh, the, oh, so I gotta go back there. Wow. Okay, I'll be right back. All right. So, okay. <sighs> Are we ready? I'm a little nervous, but I think it's gonna be fine. I don't actually think it's gonna be that difficult. If it's anything like, um, I remember it when we were doing Polaris, um, the annoying minions of the rat were kind of this way. They had like complete invulnerability, but they were kind of different because they could like self-destruct. <laughs> Francie fries. Okay, um, I ended up adjusting my deck because I thought, okay, he's going to have minions for sure, so I'll probably just use those. Um, she is not a big threat to me, so I think I'm just going to use these. I can still probably get away with this deck, um, probably tackling her, so, yeah. She's a myth anyway, so, like, myths, myth is a joke. No offense, but let's be real here. When it comes to Storm, it's a joke. I'm just kidding. I love all the myths out there, but like, I love Storm better. So I'm just, I'm just being honest. Sorry, but anyways, okay. So okay, wow, you you stunned me. Very clever. Strategy here is just to probably stack up a bunch of blades and faints on her. Um, they'll just. I think they have. They don't have a lot of health. They're like three thousand. So Glowbug. I said Glowbug. Glowbug. I don't even know what I, why I said that. Um, okay, I've just got. Um, mm, 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 I don't really need Triton for this one. Yeah, I'm stunned anyway, so it wouldn't really matter. So I can get the Shadow Pip. Um, put it on, and then get everything out taken care of. Okay. He's what I'm worried about. Then the reason why is because if he's got resist, anyways, I was um that kind of relates back to the uh, um it relates back to uh, those little minion things when you're fighting the rat because they're able to increase their resistance um, as they like I guess get older, quote unquote. But the difference between them and I guess this guy is that. Um, he doesn't die out, um, he just persists, you know? This should, this will probably cast a stun, but the, I already have the shield on, so, yeah. Myth Banshee will stun you for a round, but with that, that kind of overpowers it, so then you're kind of safer. And... Okay, good, good, good. Alright, um... I want to hit now, but I'm not entirely positive that I have enough. She has the 80% faint on. Um... So... It would probably kill her, but I'm not going to take any chances. I want as many blades as possible. And they don't... Oh, uh, what is that? That's an unusual spell. I don't... I've never seen that before. That's just why I'm kind of a little curious. If I can critical, that would be great, but I'm not sure. Okay, we're good. If she doesn't block it. Okay, yeah. Ugh. <laughs> this sounded like they had a hairball. I don't think so. Go to the entrance hall. This doesn't seem right. What's wrong? I want to I want to fight him. Eastar. 
Oh, this looks like the exact same place. Okay, Genie. You are. I guess I forgot to tell you to turn, right? When you got into the manor. <laughs> Silly me. Anyways, come this way and meet the Baroness. Baroness. I think of uh, G.I. Joe with uh, Baroness. The bad guy. Bad girl, I mean. Alright. It's... No, oh, there's so many cats I just show us that. Teddy, she had the strength, but he had her thrown into a snakish prison in Istanbul. Oh, I am too sad. Istanbul. Thank the sands. If I have to listen to more weeping, I'll vomit. <laughs> Teddy is truly the only hope for House Galaxy and your alliance. Freeing her, though, would be impossible. Let's, let's talk outside. Or better yet, let's just, let me have him, let me face him, I can, I can take him, uh, bring it on. I think she also adds some pierce as well, let me check the, yeah, okay, she adds some, psych, no she doesn't, she doesn't add anything, she just sits there, and wait, no, she does, she does, 10% accuracy. So I have almost uh, no chance of. Baroness knows the Baron must be overthrown, but she's squeamish. Best not to talk in there. Centuries ago, after the reign of the Persians. Okay. Ew, and it's a good thing they were defeated. I can't. St How very interesting. Anyway, after they were defeated, this to rescue Teddy, you first need to. F the Mongols are wary of outsiders, but they are mortal. Great. Okay, so we got a. Uh... Rescue the girl and then fight him. So I don't know if we'll be able to fight him today. It'd be kind of cool if we did get to, but. That must be the Mongu. The Serpentines had subjugated everyone, even the Nomads. So the Mong. All that history stuff is confusing, you know? What matters is they can help us, I guess. <laughs> Hey everybody, welcome back, it's me, Babaroo. Um, okay, so, I didn't actually get to finish the video from yesterday, because I had a few errands to run, so I, um, I had paused it, and, um, some, like, I made sure that, like, the video recording was, like, done and stuff, because I knew I wasn't going to be able to return back to the video before I, like, kind of ran out of time and stuff. Um, so if you're wondering why it looks a little bit different, why, I, like, for one, I'm wearing a different shirt, and, like, um, it's a different day, and it's taken me a little bit wa a little bit longer to um, do the video. Um, the reason why is because I had um, some stuff to do yesterday, and I just didn't have time to finish the video. So um, I'm doing the video for today. I'm gonna go ahead and finish it. Um, and basically, what I'm gonna do is we're gonna go into this uh, Ruble Waste place and. Um, or taffy place and like I did a little bit of research on the there's three weasels that you have to fight there's um what is their names Ricky and then the other one has an a T name I think it's um Toffee and then there's Taffy I think so I have to defeat them the good news is these guys aren't that bad um they have cheats though which is um Always a struggle because, for one, it gets really aggravating having to put up with um, cheaters because I don't really like cheaters, but I mean, it's you gotta deal with them. Um, so, the strategy with him, I made up a deck and um, was able to do some like research on it, and I think this is actually is a good deck. So, for this guy, Ricky, um, if you place a blade on that does not have a um, Aegis charm on it, then he will remove it because he's a blade remover. Um, you could get away with it by not using H just by using something like diffuse. Um, I think it's diffuse or evaporate or something or dissipate. That's the one because I think he uses um, enfeeble and disarm, which are both storm spells. Um, so having something like Aegis or that can uh, counteract uh, his spell. 
Um, the next one I'll talk about, okay, uh, this is not good because he used sirens. Um, so that's going to remove that, but it should be fine. Um, I also did some research on this guy, and he actually has a boost to storms, despite the fact that he's a storm wizard, or storm guy, whatever you'd want to call it. And he also is being a little bit tough today. Um, that's not good. Um, so anyways, um, strategies for getting rid of him, I think, are just... Hope for a miracle? No, I'm just kidding. Um, um, I'm trying to think what would be the best strategy for him. Because like, my strategy is going to work, I hope, I think. I'm praying for a miracle that it will. Um... I don't need that. I need what they need to do is they need to make an R that increases the chances of you getting a shadow pip. I think would be kind of cool. Um, I'm just gonna be sitting here with no shadow pip. Okay. Um, good lord, have mercy! I'm just gonna have to use this. I feel like it won't kill him unless, of course, I critical, but. That is heavily dependent on if I critical. Or if the game likes me. The luck factor, yeah, it's not favoring me right now. It doesn't like me. But it doesn't matter, because I didn't need luck on my side to kill him. So, see, they... It's a, it's a long dungeon, so it's kind of very long. So you have to defeat both of them now. Um... Very aggravating. Um, although, Tiki's not as bad. I thought it was Tuffy. Um, wow, I am terrible with names. Um, but, he's not as bad. He's just more of a, if you heal, he'll like, he'll be really aggravating because he uh, does stupid things like that just to make you aggravated and just um, do stupid things like that. You know, I, I don't care. But, it's fine. Um, the strategies for getting rid of both of them are just the same. You same, use the same deck. Um, pretty much just... You gotta hope for Shadow Pips. Um, hopefully that they don't get criticals. And hopefully that you critical. That's um, just what I'm planning on doing with him. Um, and it's the same way with... Uh, the one guy that we're gonna have to face after this, the Baron, um, gotta deal with him in a specific way. Okay, see, best part about his little, okay, you could also use, um, Melt, I forgot about Melt, is a strategy that you could use to override, um, his spell. Um, okay, so the cool thing about what he does is he only removes the first blade, so if you cast an Elemental Blade or a Spirit Blade, he can't remove the last two, so I think it's life, the life blade and the fire blade are what's ended up like being removed. Um, but that being said, um, it's still you have to be a little bit more cautious because if you're like a fire or life wizard, that would suck. But if you're like the other four schools that don't care about the other two, then it's fine. Um, see, he removed the protection, so I, but I had it. Alrighty. Um, I have both of them on there. I want to say that this should kill. Um, and I'm not entirely worried that it won't. So, I'll go ahead and snap at him. If I critical, then that's definitely a positive. But, that's a big maybe. Because I, I have sucky critical. It has like 60%, but it almost never actually activates. It's, it's strange. It's also storming outside. And there's like, if you can look out there, it's like, oh my god. That scared me. <sighs> okay, we got a lot of stuff from him. Let's see here. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and use my second one because I need to make sure. Alright, so, you really hope that you can go first with these guys. Um, You also, I might... Mm, Okay, I think this is a good deck. Um, I might put a sharpened in there because, um, actually, yeah, I'm gonna put a sharpened in there, and I'll take Aegis out. Put a sharpened in there for the elemental, so that way I can put 45% and then have that as a 
um, under the Aegis charm. So hopefully I won't be um, hosed um, by these guys because three of them, they're really annoying to fight. I don't like them <laughs> in the least, um, and I can't attack. So that's not a good. That's not a good sign. <laughs> ah no. That's not good. It's fine though. Um, okay, so strategies for all three of them. Okay, so the other guy, if you don't have Indemnity, um, that's another thing. I went ahead and bought Indemnity because I saw that uh, the third guy, Taffy, whatever his name is, um, he will cheat, um, cast something to remove uh, or swap the um, blades or the tr faint with you. So if you cast Indemnity, he can't, he can't do anything about it. So that's why I went ahead and bought it. So, um, oh, this is a new spell, I think. Is this a new one? I've never seen this before, so I can't. That is so cool. I like that already. That is cool. Okay. I like that. <laughs> Oh my god, that is pretty cool. Alright, so I don't have anything, so I'm just going to have to put this on. Um, this is not cool. This is already starting off to be a very bad game. As long as they don't critical, I should be fine. Um, but yeah, guess we'll see though, for sure. This is not going so well. Because I haven't gotten a Shadow Pip yet. I haven't gotten my blades. It's kind of just been like re reorganizing it in a way that it seems like it's best to fit, I guess. Hmm. Okay. We're good. Alright. Indemnity on the faint. Um, go ahead and place that on that. Um, I'm gonna put it on Taffy because he's one, he's got the most health, so that would probably be a big major issue to deal with because you don't want to end up dealing with them when they have a lot of health. Block it, block it, block it. It is, um... What is that? Blizzard? It's been so long since i played with ice. It Blizzard's not a bad spell. It's just... It's weaker. Um... But it's actually... It's a, it's a spam spell that I would... I mean, if I was an ice wizard, I'd use it kind of as a spam spell. Um... See, he'll be like, one dirty trick deserves another. So then he'll cast something to try and remove it, and Indemnity kind of overrides that and prevents it from happening. Um, so that's another positive about that. Um, hopefully, keep our fingers crossed, that we can get um, a Shadow Pip next round, because if not, we're doomed. We're just going to die, and I don't want to die. <laughs> I just want to survive. I want to live. Just let me live, please. I think it's kind of cool. They're all in like synchronized order. It's Taffy, Tiki, and oh, I'm sorry. What is your name again? Ricky. <laughs> I completely forgot his name. There we go. Okay. Okay. We have enough that we can just straight on jump right through that Pierce. Um, we have enough piercing ability, that armor piercing ability, that's what I'm trying to say, I can't, I'm not good with words. And we have enough, um, accuracy that this shouldn't be an issue. Oh my god! Oh my god! So scary. I don't want to die. I'm a little nervous about these guys, because I just hope this works. But he'll block it. But it's fine. That should kill him. What? You're kidding me. It doesn't matter. You're dead. Ha! Take that! And as punishment for your crimes, I'm going to make sure that you suffer. Big time. You don't have enough in you to kill me, because I have a thousand. And, and I have enough accuracy to damage you for eternity. So, ha! Uh, yes! Take that! He'll block it, but it doesn't matter. He doesn't have enough in him to stop me. Goodbye. Yes! Our 
drag someone out of a snakish prison on Eastern Moa? Why didn't you say so? You have come to the right place. Let's Let's talk outside. First off, let me heal, because you battered uh, my health pretty bad. Um, oh, I need to be level 116. That's not good. Um, hmm. Talk to Taffy and Ruba Waste. I like how they're all just sitting there in, like, synchronized order. They're kind of cool. I like them. My brothers and I have discussed your delicious request. Delicious. We would be delighted to help liberate someone from Istanbul. Okay, I kind of like them, but I'm a little nervous now. I don't have that uh, extra uh, armor piercing ability. See, they kind of. Sh she's what kind of boosted it, but actually, psych, not that. No, wait, no, no, no. She boosted my accuracy, so it doesn't matter. Alright, well, that's not bad. Alright, okay. Oh, good lord. I've got to fight two of them. i got to be careful, because I don't want to fight that boss. That boss looks a little terrifying to me. Okay, good. Alright, so... Yeah, they're weak. I don't need to worry about them. I'll put the sharpened blade on that. Mm, don't need that. I don't even need Aegis for this, to be honest. I'll go ahead and put it on that. I'm just looking for Glowbug right now. I, I keep saying Glowbug. Glowbug. Lore Master is a cool spell. It's very effective um, at reducing damage, but I don't think it should save you because it's what twenty percent and then thirty-five. Hmm, interesting. Not a problem. No, it's not. We got this. Yes, we do. Alright, okay. Let's see here what we should do. I said what we should do. What we should do is... Nothing. We need, don't need that. Go ahead and put that on there. Oh, it's a tough one, but I don't need it. I have enough damage to kill him. I think. I hope. I really want to believe that. That's kind of cool. He's like, oh, yeah. Whew. Oh, that's another thing they should add. They should add something like, you know, they have potent trap for faint and like sharpened blade for blades. They should have stuff like, um, things that you can add to weakness and um shields like a 10% that'd be cool I'd actually really be interested in something like that see I've already pointed out two things that's true before you like what drown suffocate whatever you'd call it I need health give me health all right, Dooms Genie. All right, here you go. One. That is pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. And you're welcome very much. Now, if you don't mind, Whew. I have to get back to wandering the dunes. Goodbye. All right. Them a 
Make sure the djinn don't try to close the snake's maw and trap you inside. Go in and find you. Be strong. Area not available right now. Okay, so I have to buy the zone. Not a big deal. Oh dear, this is so scary. Here we are, the Serpentine Gate. The Serpentines built Istanbul to escape the surface, but now many in their leader, Cobra Commander, maintains a ruthless foot. The gate captain keeps the gatehouse locked. Defeat enough Viper soldiers to lure him out, and I'll sneak in and unlock the door for you. I don't like the sound of this. I'll just go ahead and put this on, and then next round I'll just show them who's a boss. Yeah, maybe we'll see. Probably doubtful, but they had it coming. Bring it! Oh my God! I see. I could have used that earlier, and then I wouldn't have been so like in such a panic. Been like. <gasps> <laughs> What's the matter? You pathetic excuses for snakes. Can't handle some riffraff from the sands. Ah, run. That's some iron ore right there, right there. Oh dear. What are we getting ourselves into? We're gonna get trapped, we're gonna get killed, we're gonna get destroyed, it's gonna be awful. I need a brown paper bag. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I don't need that. Um, oh dear. Alright. Does this guy. This makes no sense. How did you sneak into Captain Stratovipers? Does he have. I'm gonna check real quick to see if he's got any cheats. Just, you know, that would be kinda necessary. Alright, so he has no cheats. Okay, he has no cheats, so but he does have a lot of health, so I went ahead and stockpiled my um, deck with some like some pretty good spells if I do mean to say so myself, you know. <laughs> I'm just kidding now. Um I just I put um, some more blades, um, I put um, faint in because I was wasn't exactly sure if he was gonna like need it or anything. I feel like I'm gonna put it on him just to be safe that way. I mean even if I don't if I didn't have fan, I'm pretty sure I probably could with the amount of blades I'm going to blade. Um, he does have a few things, like he has Dark Pack, which is another thing um, that gives him a boost. Um, I didn't see that he uses Bad Juju, which would be kind of a little annoying because Bad Juju would end up uh, causing me to lose, I think, like 90% of the damage I would output. So that's something I want to be very careful to not have him do. Because if he ends up doing that, then I kind of lose the chance of a lifetime at snapping out of me like pew, pew. But, hopefully he doesn't actually have that in the little like website thing just got it wrong. Let's hope that's not the case. <laughs> so, but yeah. So, um, we'll take him out. Okay, good. Um, but still, I need to wait, weather it out just a little bit more. I need to put faint on him because as you can see, he's got quite a lot of health. They have some pretty, I kind of like what they've done with Mirage, they've kind of actually made it a little bit more realistic, you know? Um, okay, whew. I was a little scared for a minute, I was like, is that, is that what I think it is? I don't know, I'm always like a little hesitant, because like, bad juju is kind of annoying. Um, I'm gonna go, I'm just gonna put the indemnity on it, and the reason why is, in case one of them has something that could remove it, I don't want to take that risk and then, like, be stuck with this battle for a long, long time. So, I'm gonna take care of it. Too bad you don't have the 30% on, I'm sorry.
I still did a lot of damage. But it shouldn't be anything of a big issue. The only thing I'm worried about is he's got... He's hopefully... He's hopefully... Uh, um, unfortunately, he's going to have a lot of um, stockpiling up there. I'm wondering if I want to hit now or... I want to put this on. And the reason why is I want to make sure that I have an extra blade on there. Hopefully, Sirens can't remove more than two um, blades. So... I can hopefully keep two of my storm, two or three of my storm blades, um, and then hurl this their direction. Okay, I knew he was gonna attack me. It's just I'm hoping it's sirens and not something. Okay, Catalan. Catalan does what? It reduces your accuracy by I think 25 percent. So not a big deal. Um, I'm wondering what he's gonna cast. Oh dear. Oh god. We're doomed. We're gonna die. Oh! Please don't fizzle. That was scary. I didn't think that Catelyn would do that much damage, but then I, I for, I'm just getting to this level and I'm like, oh yeah. We're at a point where it doesn't really matter how much health you got. We'll go into the prison. Oh, where am I going? I don't even know where I'm going. We're just running in some random direction. Throw the switch and the massive gears begin okay. to grind. Outside, you hear the serpentine gate being raised. Alright, Tiki. I hope that they, these, like, mongoose guys don't die. That would, like, totally be, like, total, like, sadness. Be like, <laughs> <sighs> but, I don't think they do? I don't remember it. Oh man, I should have actually waited to use those. Oops. Oh dear. Where you at, Taffy? Taffy! Where you at? Taffy! Schedule? It's schedule. Cabraxis. Cabraxat. I'm trying to think. Usually they take their names and like make a. Make a. Like, it's almost like a parody of like someone else's name or like a. Um. Like a. What would you call it? Mm, don't know the name of it. So I have to. Oh, what does he give? 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 Blah, 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 blah. Oh, he gives some. Uh, he gives damage. Yes, that's what I was hoping. I like this guy already. I just hope he isn't a traitor. Uh, I don't want to be betrayed. Okay. All right. I'm gonna take a picture of my deck because I'm gonna adjust it to 
what it was um, beforehand because that was pretty much a uh, a pretty easy way to deal with them because you had a limited number of cards and you didn't even have to worry about like all the stuff that would be in it you need three of these so take two of those out I don't even need that or that or that or that pretty much it all right good and we don't even need that either I think we're good. All right, and they're myth too. Oh, good lord! Oh no 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 no! Oh, thank goodness! I, I thought if that boss was in there, then I might not have survived this battle. We might have just had to take the uh, big bad L and uh, just gone on with our lives. <laughs> like, yeah. but he didn't get in, so we're good. Go block it, block it, block it, block it. Yes. All right. Uh oh. Oh, I was about to say, I was like, why is it not working? What's going on here? Uh, okay. Go ahead and put this on. Now, hopefully, we can get a shadow pit next round, and then we'll just take it from there and just. Like, I don't know. Wipe the floor with his face, but like. Ha <laughs> No, I'm just kidding. Whew. Thankfully, that was not a. Oh my god! Um. Let's see, nine. I need at least one more. I'll go ahead and put the elemental blade on. That should give us some extra damage and then we can take him what is that that's um reliquary reliquary whatever you call that word I can't I never can say that word right. oh. okay um I don't need that okay we're just gonna bite the bullet and throw this on him. It causes 1100 to 2200, about 2500, and then with the, all the blades and stuff, it should be at least like 5000. I'm betting 10,000. I was way off. I meant, I meant I bet 16,000. When it, and when it's not critical. Well, never mind. They don't have uh, any uh, healing little red things here, do they? Boa Constructor, that's pretty funny. Oh, there he is. You've learned the location of the architect studio? Very good. I went ahead and scouted out the preschool. It, it is an atro- Yeah, well, they don't call it Tetris Prison for nothing. It's a jumble of edges and angles. Impossible to navigate. Everyone snake responsible is architect Anthemius. He's a art. He has the blueprints of the prison. That's what we need to rescue him. We need health. Alright. Okay. We'll take him by surprise. Okay. I don't know his name, so I can't. Um, <laughs> what is his name? It's architect Anthem. Blah, 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 blah. Architect and he yes there we go all right okay so it shows that he has no cheats but he also has bucos of health so put that um those blades back in and then we will be good to go so i'm thinking probably what we need to do is um at least have two uh what are they called faints in uh, not faints. Oh wow, I can't say, I can't speak right. Um, at least all these in there. Um, two tempest, and add another glow bug, and mm, we already have two blades in. Um, Q 
keep the Aegis in just to be on the safe side. I'm not going to put faint. Well, no, no faint, no faint. I'm going to not do it with a faint. What's wrong with Tetris? Is that Snake Plissken, the only prisoner to ever escape from Tetris? More to my shame. But uh, yeah, you and everybody else. Escaping the prison was one thing. Escaping the city is another. Let's just say I... Well, I appreciate you providing me with this opportunity. Apprehending you will help restore my standing. Ha <laughs> ha! Guards! Probably not, but... You keep thinking that. Keep telling yourself that, buddy. Alright. First things first, go ahead and put that on there. Go ahead and put the storm blade on, because we need uh, to blade as much as possible. And hope for a miracle. Um, I hopefully I can hit uh, hopefully I can hit with um whatever it's called. Uh, I don't know what it's called. Ha! Huh, what is it called? I don't remember what it's called. Dear goodness me, what is it called? I forget what it's called. Okay, he's... What is that called? That is... Not that, that's a stun. I'm talking about the thing that he put on there. That's, uh... Is it called charge? I think it's charge. I'm stunned, so why does it matter? Good thing is they don't have any blades. So we're good. Alright. On second, I probably should have put the faint in there. But, too late now. I do have treasure card faints, but I, n I don't actually have them in, because I don't really use treasure cards unless I actually have to. Alright. Um, Alright, you win. Okay, so probably I'll hit next round, unless of course he tries to do like one of those, oh thank god, I was like really scared that he was going to use like Earthquake or something, because only one of my blades is actually protected, but I don't think he thought that far ahead, or if he did maybe he was like, you know what, I'll spare this guy because he's like not one to fight me that much, and who could blame him? Mm, 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 mm. Here we go. But it doesn't matter. Should kill you. Oh, what? 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 Oh dear. That's not good. Ooh. It's pretty bad. But it doesn't matter. Even if you wanted to survive, you can't. He's like, what? No! No! Ugh! Enough! I know when I've made a mistake. It may be the only thing I know how to do well. <laughs>
I'm kind of I kind of like him, but I don't trust him at the same time. So, Taffy, where are you at, Taffy? I like your name, Taffy. Last, the architect destroyed his copy of the Tetris Prisa blueprints. Curse on bad luck. We must persist in our cause. Do I look discouraged? Misfortune's my middle name. The day my luck turns, we just have to find this head constructor is a boy. That means we'll have to knock around some bone constructors. Won't be. I don't know. I suspect this weasel. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Alright people, well that's pretty much all the time I have for today. Again, I apologize for it being a little bit later in uploading this video and Again, like I said, I had some stuff I had to do, um, kind of couldn't get to it at the moment, um, so um, it ended up being a two-day thing. This will be a two-part series, probably, um, but yeah, um, if you enjoyed this video, I, I hope you did. Um, thank you for watching, and I'll see y'all next time.